What's going on everyone? My name is Roscoe and we are back. So yesterday was Air Max Day and overall, I didn't think it was that bad. You know, at least it was shoes that was worth going for. Nike's definitely making a push on the Air Max 1 silhouette. We had the blueprint and then you had the concepts far out. Now the blueprint Air Max ones were really nice. I actually kind of dig them, but unfortunately for me, I did take an L on the sneakers app. You know, <laughs> it's a common theme. Overall, it's a solid shoe. Congrats to anybody that did hit on that. It's just kind of weird that Nike would make an Air Max a little bit limited. You know, it is Air Max day, so why wouldn't you, you know, at least bump it up a little bit? But the main prize of the day is the concepts far out Air Max ones. Now those were available online, but we did hit yesterday on the in-store raffle. Yesterday was a little bit different. They didn't put most of the stock online. So I did see a lot of W's. It was a lot of pairs. The price for these is really high. And I think maybe that kind of turned a lot of people off. I don't know. I hit a size 10. I struck out on a size 12. I screwed up on those boxes. Ah, I do have a size 10 on the way but this was a nice little surprise. We got a little Sunday vlog action. How many pairs did you cop this week, huh? How many pairs you bought it this week? Good job, man. Hmm. All right, so <laughs> what are we gonna rock today? I don't know. We got a lot to choose from here. I actually been getting rid of a lot of sneakers. I don't like to say downsizing because I'm really not. I just got more shoes coming in. I do have a limit, so if I don't really love it, I have been getting rid of a, a couple of them at least. So we gotta rock something Nike, right? Nike. Do we rock dunks? Should we pull some dunks today? Jordan Fours it is. <laughs> when in doubt, bread for us. Yeah, we got 10 minutes. 10 minutes! We made it, we're in the city. We got a like, nice little parking spot. I love this little place. It's like, kind of like, I would say three or four blocks away from Concepts. We're gonna head there, go check it out. Hopefully they'll let me film in the store. All right, so this time, not a long line, which is great. If you guys remember the Mellows, when we had to wait for the Mellows, there was about 100 people in line, and they have a huge, you can see already, there's like a huge globe of like flowers, or like a huge thing, so it's right there. We're gonna go in, check it out, man, go get our shoes. Secured, secured. We got the shoes and I couldn't really show you guys too much, but they hooked it up, man. Shout out to Concepts, bro. They gave us a little gift. Woo, man, Concepts, man. They hold it down. The inside was sick. I love the whole kind of vibe that they went with the whole 60s theme. You had the moss all laid out on the floor with all the shoes. All the employees were rocking the shoes too, so it was dope. It was definitely a cool experience, man. They told me that they knew they were gonna screw everyone up because what they did was they flipped it. So Friday's winners were the small sizes and yesterday's winners were all the big sizes. So that's why, <laughs> that's why we didn't hit on Friday. They only raffled the small sizes and did big sizes on Saturday. So we got it. Let's go head home and let's, uh, let's take a look at these. You're good? We gotta do a little band review. I'll show you guys what Concepts hooked it up with right after when we get home. And then here we go, we get the special box, Bane. So this is the special box that is exclusive to Boston, if I can get it out. You guys will be getting a box like this uh, for the in-store, but it won't be pink. So the pink box is exclusive for US, uh, for uh, Boston. Oh, just it's a box within a box. It's a box within a box. Let's open this up. Comes with all the goodies. We'll put that. We'll yeah. take a look at all this stuff later. But Woo! got them. We got them. What Boy. do you think? Smell it. Is it good? No. These are nice. These are sick. All right. So secured. Let's drive back home and let's take a more detailed look at them when we get back home because we do have a little bit of a drive. Chicken and W's. Let's go home now. Ah. Uh. The shoes secured, and we got an extra item that we're gonna take a look at. 
Overall, man, the store is really cool. The whole exhibit is really nice. Shout out to Concepts, man. <laughs> Shout out to Concepts. Uh, they ended up hooking me up with this, with the purple crew neck, which is actually really nice. Now I have something to rock with these shoes. Yeah, damn, woo, super nice, I like it. Here are the sneakers. Let me take this box out, and then again, it's got like the spirals. The extra accessories, which is this lime green bandana. So it just says, love or confusion. 1969 uh, concepts, you got little concepts. Oh, this is the the record, <laughs> the coasters. So these are the little record coasters. Well, let's take a look at the shoes. Whew. These are crazy. And I like the denim. I like the color of the denim that they did. They just did a regular kind of blue denim for it. I think that kind of fits the vibe really well. And then of course you have the flowers on the swoosh on the inside. And then they course, the guitar pick. <laughs> they did change the color on the guitar pick, bluish with the yellow Concepts logo. I think this is gonna be one of the better uh, sneakers of 2022. Let me know what you think. Maybe not this particular colorway. I know everyone's gonna have their favorites between you know, mellow, heavy, or far out. One of these gotta make the list. I know Concepts always does a Nike collab every year. They absolutely crushed it on this pack. I'm excited. I'm excited to see if Concepts drops anything else uh, this year in 2022. We'll see if they do something maybe fall, winter. I don't know if they will. I know they do a bunch of other stuff. They do work with New Balance. They do work with Adidas. These are nice. These are sick and I'm really, really happy. Woo! These look good. Yeah, I only have mellows. I don't have heavies. Heavies I ordered online um, and they should be in uh, at some point. Uh, but these are nice. These are sick too. These are super clean. So let me know which concept Air Max one is your favorite out of the pack. I personally think heavy is gonna be my favorite. And then I would say the far out and then last, I would say mellows. And I wouldn't be shocked if the resale value skyrockets on this sneaker. I know it's not a lot right now. You know, this being $230, you know, that's gonna hurt the resale value. If you're paying that much amount of money for an Air Max One, I do think over time, these will go up. Let me know, did you manage to cop the concepts far out? I will have a full detailed review of this sneaker very, very soon. Again, a huge shout out to Concepts again. All right, if you guys did enjoy this video, make sure you guys do smash that like button and subscribe. And like always, I'll catch you in the next video. I'm out. Peace.